group of orcas, better known as killer whales, they appear to be attacking and even sinking some boats off the coasts of Portugal and Spain. The question this morning, why? NBC's chief international correspondent, Keir Simmons, joins us with this story. Keir, what's happening? Hey, Craig, good morning to you. This is one of these uh, funny, not funny stories. Not funny if you're in uh, one of uh, these boats. The, the pictures that you're about to see are incredible. A, a group of whales, of killer whales, is called a pod. But maybe they should be renamed a gang or a troop or an army because the scientists are trying to figure out exactly what's happening in the water. A British couple setting sail off the coast of Morocco when a group of killer whales started battering their boat. The orcas continuing the barrage for at least an hour. They managed to keep the 46-foot sailing yacht afloat, but just days later, another vessel was not so lucky. Three killer whales struck the rudder inside of the sailboat, eventually causing it to sink as the Spanish Coast Guard rushed to the rescue. It's one of at least three boats that have sunk because of the orcas since last summer, and many more have been seriously damaged in the last three years. According to researchers, there were about 15 orca interactions when this began in 2020. Incredibly, that number has now ballooned into the hundreds by 2023. And all of them happening here along the Iberian Peninsula. It doesn't fit with anything we've ever seen anywhere else in the world. Scientists are stumped. So, three theories. One is the whales are super stressed. They're acting out because the, o the oceans are too noisy. Theory two, the Jaws theory. Some experts believe the sea creatures may be out for revenge. Organising the attacks after a whale in the pod, possibly a female called White Gladys, was hit by a boat. Experts say orcas are very social and do often learn behaviour from one another. But Andrew Trites with the University of British Columbia believes a less aggressive option is most likely. Playtime. Killer whales will rush up behind a boat and sometimes put their snout straight into the propeller wash and feel it's almost like a jacuzzi. No injuries have been reported and killer whales have not been known to harm humans. But if the whales think they're having fun, for terrified sailors, the joke's gone too far. Indeed. I mean, I, you know, fortunately, I guess for us, it sort of seems like it's isolated there right now. Or, I mean, or is it? Here, I mean, are researchers concerned that there may be more orca pods like these out there? Thankfully not, uh, Craig. There's 39 whales in this pod, and so far it doesn't appear as if this kind of whale trend, if you like, to target boats is spreading. But again, they don't know exactly what is happening. The research is underway. Uh, so until then, say it with me, guys. Everyone's going to need a bigger boat. Uh, uh, we were waiting for that, Kier. Yeah, yeah. If, if Roker were here, he'd be so <laughs> proud, Kier. Yes, Thank he would. You. Thank, Thank you, Kier. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.